I couldn't be sure if it was recording or not. Let's see. Let's see do that. Where is the other? Okay. I um I got my packages in the mail. Make sure it's facing me. I don't think I need this bright light in the face. I can be interrogated. Is that okay? Oh yeah, that's probably okay. Um, uh, oh, that's too much too. Let's see. Well, that's probably okay like that. Um, I got four packages in the mail today. And um, I'm looking for something. I know what some of them are because but I'm hoping that some of them are the, one of them might be the Amaco Tooth. This one is from Henderson, Nevada. I decided the other day I was going to always tell you guys where I get things from because to me that's part of the fun of collecting is getting things from different places. I have a, a a miniature 50s style lady coming from Great Britain in about a week. Anyway, I'm excited about what might be in these because some are things that I ordered for Olivia. I should have done this prior. I just got dinner made. Oh, I didn't make dinner. The old man brought chicken strips from town and then I made gravy and mashed potatoes. So I'm going to that up also going to be able to salvage that. Oh, I know what this is. Oh, awesome. It was some, some other little lady types that I found plus two, two more dancing teenage boys. Oh, how cute. Maxie and me, Inc. Park Ridge, Illinois. Is it? Oh, it is. It's tape shut. It's a bitty, bitty teeny card in there. Let's see what else is. Just thank you for something like that, I'm sure. Thank you for your purchase. I hope you enjoy. Jazzy. Oh, she even personally put my name in it. That's sweet. Okay. So, from Jasmine, I got these cute little ladies. They have a different type of skirt than the other girls that I showed you, and they're smaller. And they're jointed, they can be moved. They're cute. The problem is, these are not going to be able... Now, I know that lady showed me standing up. I know she did. She said one of the little lady's eyes open and one don't. But those would be so cute for a little see She wanted some dolls that move so that she can sit them in the chairs and stuff. I have to do some work on that. And then two more teenage dancing boys were with these, red and blue. I saw one the other day that was orange. That was so cute. That orange shirt, I think. So I got that. Those are very cute. They might not be quite what I... Well, how in the heck did she have them standing up? They're like tricky sometimes. Okay, then, Los Angeles, California, what was this? Um, anyway, so we've been having fun collecting these little things, Olivia and I. Um, it's fun to have a dollhouse, but it's especially fun to have a dollhouse if you have little people in it, or little fairies, or something living in it. <laughs> I loved my house when I was little, the one my mom got when I was little, that's very much like the one I have now. Thank you. Cute little note. This is too bright. Let's get rid of it. The sun's going down, so. Anyway, just a cute little note. And let's see. Oh! It's the little records and record. Okay. It's the little record player and records that go with which is 68 of the little records. I got that for like, I think $5. There's tons of the little records. And then there's the little phonograph that goes with it that went with those dancing kids and the ones with the telephone. 
I mean, look at all the millions of little records and all the millions, but like I said, there's 60, 68 of them. Do they have little names and stuff on them? No. But they do have some writing, but it's basically illegible. Dot. They have like real little labels on them. MGM, they do have little labels. And then the little record players. So there's a whole bunch of those. I'm going to have to be, now see some of these things I'm going to have to resell because I don't need 68 LP records for my um, dollhouse. That's just ridiculous. But I'm going to keep five and I'll just leave me five. And she has another little record here. So I like that. Very cute. Martinsville, Indiana. In bigger box. I'm thinking this might be the cheese. Um, anyway, I told you guys in that other video that I tried out those secure smile teeth, and um, they, I was um, a little, I'm very disappointed in that um, because I've seen some videos where people just raved about them, and one lady like used a little nail file, um, you know, like a Dremel type tool nail file, and, um, that's my uh, pair at home, I don't know what that is, I know, but it's being abused in there. <laughs> anyway, um, and she, like, filed them down and made them very thin, made them more like a shell, and I'm thinking I might have to do that. What the heck, I can't. I may have to get the little Dremel tool and... I have the, one of those little nail tools, and I will use it to file them down and make them fit closer, and I'm hoping that maybe I can make them work, because I like the material that they're made of, so much more than the knuckle material, because um, they're more like a, like a den, more like a denture material. Oh, okay. These are some green ones, light green ones, just like that other little girl scout that I showed you earlier. And a green one that's standing on her belly like the brownie that I want. Let me get her up. Just like the little brownie that I want. So now I know for sure these are the perfect size. Again, I have determined. Oh, cute. These ones have red hair. I think these must be... Who had these colors? This is really like a pea green, like bright green, not girl scout green, but green. They called these Girl Scouts, but I'm thinking maybe they were, uh, what was that other, was it Campfire Girls? Campfire Girls, that were they this color? I don't remember. Anyway, so that's great. There's some smaller ones to Olivia. See, now these would be like the mom to this size, too. This would be like the mom size. Okay, Olivia the red bulbs, so she's got a bunch right there. I told her that I have to open this stuff before, because I wanted to make a video. I want to stay on top of telling you guys how my collection's growing. Where, where did I say that was from? Martinsville, Indiana. Okay, now, Bradenton, Florida. I also have a little miniature Bambi at Disney, at Disney Bambi coming. I know I have some Um, that... I really one about four ninety nine cents. Can't believe that. I'd like to expand on my Disney figurine collection, and I'd like to have, get more brownie collection collectibles too. Because oh, it is. It's my new Mako teeth. Okay, awesome. So that kind person who I had promised that I would make the fitting for fitting video for, I will get that done, and um, tonight, I'm excited, okay, here's, this is the box that they come in, and there's, what's in there is, um, the Amaku I'm going to show you what they look like when you first get them, I'll show you again when I make the regular video, but I'll show you these, I have one that needs a repair, um, 
that I had gotten stuck in my mouth and I had to cut it out. And um, so I had just saved the teeth part. And those are going to be my everyday ones, the front part. And then um, these ones are going to be just for, only for videos. This side. They just come like this and they're flat and they're very flexible. Oh, it's just too much light. They're flat and very flexible. And they've got some plastic stuff on the back. Already glued to it. That's the dang difference. Because that's already in a long strip. The right amount of stuff. And when you get this warm and place it over your teeth and you kind of do that. Suck it up against your teeth and you get a nice... Um, to get a nice um, fit to your to your own teeth. Anyway, I'm going to show you guys how to do that because somebody asked me to do that. Oh, and I'm going to show you how to cut the little friend and thing if you need that done. So anyway, I'll be back. I'm going to be back with that video and not very long at all. And um, but anyway, I wanted to share those little people with you and, and um, what I've been getting in the mail because I've been a little crazy with that eBay shopping. Yeah, that's an addiction of mine. All right. Peace be blessed.